What I love about coconut is nothing goes to waste. You know, you can squeeze out some milk from it and this um, nice husk, you can use it as fiber. In uh, I also add it in dosa batter sometimes and fry it up. So it's, it's, it's a really nice way to use every bit of the coconut. Today I'm going to teach you how to make coconut milk at home. It's very simple. You need some shredded coconut. You can cut it into pieces however you want. You need a blender of course, you know, a regular blender. You need some warm water, right? Not hot, warm water. And you need a cloth. It could be a t-shirt, it could be any cloth. But you need a cloth to squeeze out the juice. I have about two cups of coconut here and I will add about two to three cups of warm water to this. Why warm water and not cold water is because the warm water helps to extract the fat from the coconut milk. So now it's ground and I'm going to squeeze out the first juice and maybe I will grind it again maybe and get out some more juice but this is nice and well ground this coconut. Now you see, um, this liquid is a little bit warm, not, not really warm, but room temperature because it's, um, I used warm water and it really helps in extracting, I mean the juice comes up beautifully with that, look at that. So just use a cloth, clean hands and squeeze it. We all use a lot of coconut, you know, in our cooking and sometimes we eat coconut as well. Uh, we know it's really high in good fats, but it's also high in manganese and copper. You see how much more milk I've got from the coconut because I used a bit of warm water. That's a trick. Now, another thing you could do is, um, you know, grind this again and a little more warm water and get, you know, the second, uh, the second uh, press of the coconut milk. But I won't do that. You know what I do with this coconut? is I keep it in the fridge and I use it every day in my oats. So I got really high fiber oats because this is a lot of good fiber in it. So I keep it in the fridge and every day I use it in my uh, oats, rolled oats and uh, make it really nutritious. Now what I do is I will keep this milk in the fridge. I put it in a bottle, you can put it in any bottle. The question is how long can you keep this milk? Uh, you can keep it for about five days in the fridge. Now what do I do with this milk? I use it in everything. I use it in uh, oats, I use it in my dosa batter sometimes, I make a curry out of it, I use it in smoothies sometimes. You know, watermelon uh, coconut milk smoothie is really yummy. So I use it in that and I have a lot of use for this. If this video is helpful, hit the share button and share it with a friend.